Hey guys, so as you guys saw in the image, oh well not image, the previously clip, that as you can tell, Amaya is sick. That's why I haven't really vlogged today and like yeah, like my daily vlog and I guess you guys are probably wondering where's the vlog at. So right now I'm just going to do this since I know now what to use when you have a sick baby. I'm going to actually do this vlog real quick for you guys um, of what I use, what I, the stuff that I've been using since she's been sick. And she's actually been sick since Friday, and she's not feeling good. And like just now, she I had to prop her up on my pillow, and I put her in her crib because she just can't breathe, and her her humidifier is going in the room. So that's one of the things I have to, but I don't have it with me because it's in the room going, you know? So the first thing I'm going to show you guys, wait, I'm not sure. So like, you know, I use the humidifier, and this is what I put at the top of the humidifier is I use this uh, Vapor Steam. It's for cough supplements. Wait, cough, coughs? Oh, sorry guys, I'm like reading wrong. Cough suppressant for use in hot steam vaporizer. Like it's just for the, you know, you put it at the top, before the top. I'll show you, I'll insert a clip real quick of what it looks like right here. So yeah, I use this and I pour it in for her. The next thing, it's not the same as Caitlyn's. Caitlyn's actually just went off in. It's um, this machine, it's just break this, um, what is it? I don't know, it's just, it's um, a nebulizer, nebulizer, there you go. Uh, I just give it to her a few times so she can breathe. They gave her medication for it as well. Cause I can't, she's still young. So technically she's a newborn still cause she cannot um, take any medicine really. So I used this and it helps a little bit. Like I just did it before she fell asleep. And since she's sick, she can't, she's eating breast milk but she's having a hard time cause she's spitting it up a lot. So I have Pedialyte and there's no sticker on it cause it's been a figure. I've been using this Pedialyte cause she does not like it cold. I warm it up and I put it in this kind of bottle. Bottle. It's a breast flow bottle because I use this kind as in her regular bottle because she's not quite used to this fast type liquid coming out of a bottle. So I put it in here so it can come out slower. Because look, as you can tell on the um, top, it's like a double top. Like there's two of them, and so the the juice comes up here and then it flows out. It's slower. So like that's how I look. And sorry about the lighting, guys. Like I'm doing this video extra late. It's like. 458 so yeah and the next thing I have is some uh, Motrin for infants um, the only reason I have this is because she's actually been having a fever too so I've been giving her a little bit of Motrin to help with that fever next I have I guess I can show you guys it's kind of hard okay so first I'm gonna do this because this is what I use first. I use this, the saline drops. I spray it in each nostril twice, like so four in a total. And then I use this, the bulb thing that came at the hospital, and I suction it out. She hates it, but it gets it out, it loosens it up. And I have this, I have two of these actually. One for to squirt the stuff on, and then I have another one that has bits in the room by the side of her bed. For that reason, I put the little fix on it and leave it in there so she can breathe. And then after I spray all that and squirt it out, I add this Simply Salines Plus for babies um, nasal moist gel. And basically, it relieves dryness around the nose, no drip. So her nose won't drip, and it it says drug free, fragrance free. So yeah, her nose it, it feels good. It just apply it says apply around the nose to relieve dryness and soreness. Use as often as needed. I use it every time I clean her nose with this stuff. And then next I have the um, the vapor rub. This is a lifesaver. I use this whenever I put it on her chest, and after she got the tub, I put it on her the bottom of her feet, put her socks on. I read that, that helps with coughing, so I'll use this a lot. Another thing that I'm thinking about buying, I think I'm gonna go buy, is sorry guys, the Johnson Johnson um, the bath vapor. And I use that a lot with Kaylin and it helps so much with her sleeping at night. So I think I'm going to get that and then I'm going to go get, um, I forgot 
forgot what it's called. It's like, is it nose free? I don't know. But it's like a, the thing you suck the snot out. It's so disgusting to me, but if it helps her breathe, I don't care. So that's pretty much all that I have to, you know, whenever my baby's sick, I just try to make it happen. <laughs> So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Sorry I haven't vlogged today. Again, I hope this video was helpful for the moms that have sick babies or are becoming a mom and you needed to know what to use or whatever. But like I said, sorry I didn't vlog today. I'm just not feeling it. And then I'm tired. I don't feel good. I don't feel good. I think I ate something. made my stomach sick or something. But yeah. So I'll talk to you guys later. Thumbs up, subscribe, leave comments below what kind of other vlogs you want to see. And I'll try to do it as much as I can. I'm trying guys like don't judge me please <laughs> so thanks for watching guys bye also I want to show you guys what I'm keeping it in since I don't have like another extra basket I just keep all her medicines and stuff in this basket and I just keep it in my room for right now and like yeah I added extra stuff like this and um that's yeah that's all I added <laughs> And I'll keep this in here. And I usually keep like a, well, the extra ones either kept in my room because she's actually been sick and spitting up a lot. So, yeah, this is all that I keep in her little basket for when she's sick.